Hello, my name is Maria and this is Matthew, my mascot. In this lesson, we're going to study some area units. And area is always measured in squares of some size. And here I drew some special squares that we often use in measuring area. This first little bitty itty one is a square centimeter. It means that each side of that square is one centimeter long. And so I can find the area by multiplying the one side times the other side. And then I get one square centimeter. Look how it is written. We have cm meaning centimeter, and then this elevated number 2 meaning the squaring. Okay? The 2 comes from the idea of multiplying the centimeter and centimeter by itself. Okay? This one is a 1 square inch. Each side of this square measures one inch. So that is a one square inch. We can write it that way. One and then in and then the elevated two. There's another way to write it too, which is like this. One SQIN. And then lastly, this square here measures one square foot because this is one foot, this is one foot. Okay? So one foot times one foot and we get one square foot. Now, we're going to find the area of these two rectangles here. This one has those little tiny square centimeters. I drew them all in. But, of course, we will use multiplication to find the area, right? So, over here I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 centimeters this way. And then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 centimeters that way. So to calculate the area I would write 8 centimeters times 10 centimeters. I multiply, okay? And then I get 80 and now my unit for the area, this is very important that you put the area unit there, it is the square centimeters, like that. 80 square centimeters. And this one has inches or square inches. Here I have 6 inches this way and 4 inches that way. So to find the area, I multiply those. 6 inches times 4 inches. And then we get 24 square inches. So here I have to write the in and then squared, this elevated 2. Remember that always, okay? How about the area of this rectangle? One side is 2 feet, the other one is 5 feet. Oh, Matthew knows the answer. I'm sure you do too. You multiply 2 feet times 5 feet. And we get 10. But 10 what? Square feet. Yes. Okay. 